What's up, everybody? This is Zoya, the Russian Korean, and today I apologize for the、um, blandness of my background. The truth is, for those of you who have been subscribed to me, you know that the background is usually like a blue curtain. Well, it decided to fall off this morning, <laughs> and、uh, I've been having a hard time putting it back on. But the video needs to be made, so I was like, whatever. We'll just film with this bland white wall behind me, and、uh, you know what? It's fine. And another thing is that we are approaching. 10,000 subscribers! Yay! Now, some of you might say, "Well, Davy504 just had a six million pineapple pizza eating reveal and a headphone takeoff reveal, and you are here talking about 10,000." For me, 10,000 is a big deal. I'm、uh, not Davy yet, so、uh, yeah. For my 10K special, I kind of talked about it a little bit、uh, in my、um, recent vlog, but in the vlog, actually, I thought that I'd be able to do. Ranked,、uh, like live stream myself playing ranked for the first time because I never have. But the truth is, my level right now is nowhere near thirty, which is what I need to actually play ranked. But don't worry, I'm still gonna live stream. It's just I I won't play ranked, but I'll play some TFT, I'll play some RM, and we're just gonna have fun. Uh, you'll be able to ask me any questions you want, and、uh, I'll try to answer as much as I can. All right, so let's get to the actual video that we're going to be reacting to today, and it's KDA Pop Stars featuring Madison Beer, G Idol,、um, or Guidel, G Idol, I'm pretty sure, and Jira Burns. Music video League of Legends came out a year ago. Currently has 317 million views. Before I begin, though, let me make a confession. I've already partially seen the music video. Now the keyword here is partially. Why am I saying that? Because at the time I didn't even know that this was League of Legends because I got into League of Legends like I don't know two or something months ago. So it's not even been that long. So when I first saw the video, I I was like, okay, well I guess this is just like another another animated band, whatever. And I didn't actually watch the whole thing. Somebody showed it to me. So I would say that、uh, today's experience is probably going to be very different, which is why I can still call it a reaction. Okay, I can see from the description that the one, two, three, four girls are Ari, Evelyn, Kaisa, and Akali. So, what else is there to say? Let's go. KDA, pop stars, League of Legends. Hmm. Taun Yeop. This is Korea. They're so cool. Oh my goodness. Yeah, she's like in Korean subway. The neon lights, pretty cool. She's washing her clothes. Oh. Ah, that's where Asia comes from. Okay. I don't know how I didn't know that. Nice、uh, mask. Those nails, though. Oh, girl! You better move out of the way. I don't remember this part. I don't think I've seen it. <laughs> It's pretty cool. She's got this thing moving <laughs> on her mask. I got, like, gotta say. The dance, the style, the vocals, the progression of the song are very, very K-popers.
I think out of all of them, I like Akali. She's the one with the mask, right? <laughs> I can't dance. <laughs> KDA. By the way, when I first saw it, I had no idea what KDA stood for. I just thought like, oh, it's probably some random acronym that uh, K-pop bands like to use a lot of times. But now I actually know that KDA stands for um, kills, deaths, and assists. So I guess that's um, level up for me. Okay, impressions. First of all, I really like the song. I like the melody. I feel like a progression there. It is kind of more of a standard K-pop progression though, because we start out with the verse, first verse, right? Then there's the chorus. And uh, uh, in the second verse, usually it's like some sort of rap part, which is exactly what it was, which was my favorite moment because in the video, she has this mask that uh, has the little neon teeth and tongue moving by themselves, which was pretty cool. And then after the rap part, we usually get a chorus. And then after the chorus, again, we get a um, like a bridge, which tends to be um, either a little slower or quieter. And then it builds back up into the chorus and then we finish. And so in terms of progression, I'd say it was pretty standard, but it works. That's why it's a standard. It's because it works. And it doesn't just pertain to K-pop. It, I think, is a standard across most uh, popular music these days, which once again proves that it works. I liked the inclusion of Korean in the song. But anyway, I think this is an acknowledgement of League being so popular in Korea. So they know their demographic and they know what uh, their fans will appreciate. Overall, I think the song is full of energy and it keeps uh, driving forward, especially uh, in terms of vocals. Like towards the end, they start reaching for higher and higher notes, which is always, you know, pleasant to listen to. And now that I've seen one opening ceremony, at least, I can definitely say that this has a lot of um, a live performance potential, combining holograms with real artists and uh, making a show that like really blows you away. Yeah, this definitely has a lot of potential. I'm sure there's probably a live performance already because this came out a year ago. And of course, the last thing, but not the least thing that I want to say is that it's just cool to see the characters reworked into this world, kind of more realistic world, where they're together and they're performing together. I feel like now that I'm familiar with the characters, uh, if you were to tell me that Ari, Akali, Evelyn, and uh, who else? And Kaisa are together and they are performing in this pop band, I would be like, okay. <laughs> so it would be interesting for me to see how that plays out on screen, and it sure is um, a sight to see. What about you guys? How do you like this music video? What do you like the best about it? Who do you think looks the best? Let me know in the comment section below. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and subscribe to my channel. This was Zoya, the Russian Korean. Thanks again, and I'll see you next time. Thank you.